you know, there's a Labor Day parade that they hold on Blue Hill Avenue here. And every year for the Labor Day, there's shooting that goes on. Even this year, Labor Day, I didn't see it, but I heard that someone got killed. When you got a community like Mattapan or like Dorchester, okay, 90% black, patrol by 90% white, it's a huge problem because those jobs belong to the people of the community. You know, and you go to the white community, you don't find no black policemen patrolling a white community. So that's you no know, justice. You know, the police force in America was established to check, put black people in check, not to protect, as they would try to make us believe. Even today, you see, you know, the incidents of murder by police of innocent and armed people, because they were not, it was not a force that was created to save, guard, to protect, and give us security. These communities are flooded with drugs. Most people in this community strive for that. Get that money to get that drug, to get high, to get that money to get, to get high. It's a cycle. What are they teaching their kids? To get that money, to get that drugs, to get high. So where's the future? Every second person that passes here, you smell, you get the smell of, they pass here, they are all nice smoking, you get the smell of weed. You get intoxicated just by standing. You know? That's a lie. And it's not by accident. Drug was introduced in the community by the authorities. Okay, out of ten, one might, one kid might excel. One might come out, you know, to get an education and, and, and get a better life. One out of ten. The other nine, those are targets for the police. They go in the criminal justice system, the new industry in America. But the police, you know, they never really investigated. They don't investigate black and black crime. You know? Black man makes a complaint, they take it down, they don't go and investigate and try to find, you know, the perpetrator. That's America. The only solution to this problem is that every people has to control their own community. If we have a black chief of police, if we got a black mayor, if we have black policemen who lives in the neighborhood, they would be concerned about the crime because they live there, their families there. But who are the police that patrol this neighborhood? They don't live here. And most of them are white. If the people in power are not sensitive toward the needs of the masses, they're not going to do anything for you. Human beings by nature are good. God didn't create us drug addicts or thieves or liars or murderers. We became like that by circumstance, by the environment. So there is hope.